Judah, what up, man? Yo, you guys ready? We always ready, playboy. All right. Cody picked up that big shipment I told you about. He's in the apartment right now with the lady. Be mindful. He keep two revivals with him at all times. All right, we gonna roll out right now. All right, man. All ready, man? Hell yeah. Let's do the shit, man. Yo, show your girl got this, man. Yeah, man. She already got thinking that the delivery man's coming, bro. We've been over this shit a hundred times, fresh. She knows what to do when we get up there. We ain't leaving shit to chance, man. Bow your heads, man. Why? Just do it, man. Yo, what the fuck you keep looking at me like that? Yo, because you're the only nigga I know that asks God to hold him down before you purposely go breaking the Ten Commandments. Yeah, Fresh. You do know the Bible say some shit about thou shalt not kill, right? Preach. You do know the Bible say some shit about thou shalt not run up in a nigga's spot, put a gun in his face, and take his shit, right? Man, fuck all that. God knows my heart. That's all that fucking matters. Strap the fuck up, man. Mm. Niggas be capping on that blue app. <laughs> Won't send your location though. It's not for you. We pull up on niggas wherever they are. Wherever they are. We pull up on niggas wherever they are. Wherever they are. We pull up on niggas wherever they are. Wherever they are. We pull up on niggas wherever they are. They talk and smack. We pull up on niggas wherever they are. They talk and smack. We pull up on niggas wherever they are. Wherever they at, 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 wherever they at. I don't clout chase, I don't dick ride nah. Half me gang, I don't switch sides yeah. Niggas talk money and they still broke huh? Say they bosses and they still work what? Be my peace cause it still hurt And they kick back, make it feel uh -huh. worse Niggas act blind, better feel first For I pull up on you and it still hurts Woo. Throw your body on the backside You ain't going like it with my goon slide They'll wipe you out like a riptide wipe you out. Spin the block, they don't get tired Spin the block. Pull up on niggas wherever they at Yeah, I'm in the front, the goons in the back My finger going trigger, that thing on my lap We know you not like that, so nigga relax Chill. I'm pulling cards and I'm pulling bras These niggas is hating Yo! Come on to the back, B. You still got the same shit from last time, right? Oh, yeah. It's it's still fire, baby. What's going on? Make sure I still work. Got the cash. I ain't my money. Yo, do me a favor. No, no doubt, no doubt. I'll order some food if you hang out with we, we eat. Hey, what's up, lady? He's alone? Did you order the food? Good, good, good. You're in the hallway, right? All right, we're coming in now. Everything set up. Quicker than that. Look here, this is a recession around this bitch. Well, you ain't heard? Shit slow. Plus, the shit you giving us is straight trash. What you mean, straight trash? The shit is trash. I mean, you can't be giving us no bullshit to sell and expecting us to move it quick. Shit don't work that way. Man, I didn't ask you all of that. I just need my shit moved. It's gonna be hard to do that if they decide to go somewhere else. Man, I don't know. Figure it out. I'm not here to babysit y'all, and I'm definitely not gonna hold your hand through that process, so make sure y'all move my shit quick. Is my money? Where the fuck is Chase at? Shit, I got me the food right there. Who? This girl fuck shit, man. What got me this good? Man, don't relax, man. Man, come on, man. Chill, nigga. Yo, you bugging out, homie. Fuck her. Shit, you work out. Yo, man, relax, man. What the fuck is the rest of your money? Man, fuck you, man. Oh, shit! Fuck! Can I ask for the money? Shit, man, it's in the cereal box on the, in the kitchen. Grab the water. We gonna fuck. Fuck that, fuck
want to tell me what the fuck is going on over here? What you mean what's going on? I'm here to make sure my business is being ran smoothly. This is not how we conduct business. <laughs> so how do we conduct business then, Shay? You come to me, and I come to them. Man, whatever. Is this my money? That's your money. All right, so I'm going to see y'all in a couple weeks. All right. I don't like the way you've been moving lately. Man, whatever. I don't like the way you've been moving lately. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Yo, who the fuck is she? Who the fuck are you? Screw that. She saw your face. I gotta kill this bitch. Do it, and I'm taking all you motherfuckers to hell with me. I swear to fucking God. Listen, bitch. We just here handling business. You don't know us, and we don't know you. Roll out, man. Sure? Yeah, nigga, roll out, man. Shut me up and count this money and work. I got shit to do, man. You're fresh. You're fresh. You alright? Look at my face, bro. Does it look like I'm alright? You want that mistake? Mistake? Motherfucking Starbucks employees could afford to make mistakes. Motherfuckers who work in Burger King and McDonald's could afford to make mistakes. But a mistake in our line of work? Get your head blown off, man. That bitch of yours almost got me killed last night. If that nigga's aim had been slightly better, this wouldn't be a bandage over my face. It'd be a fucking Ziploc. I'm telling y'all, man, that shit was real sloppy. Could have got me shot and all of us killed. Yo, I spoke to her about that, Fresh. Fuck a talk. She's out, man. What? You heard me, nigga. She's out. Yo, I understand she slipped up, bro, but she's loyal. I remember the last time a nigga in this crew slipped up. Yeah, Cash knows the answer to that one. I did 10 years behind that shit. Behind another nigga slip up. Shit ain't happening again. And her cut of the money is coming out of your part of the tape. Your bitch, your idea to bring her in, your money. Ain't no way in hell I'm splitting shit with a bitch who almost got my head blown the fuck off, man. Well, that's gonna mean we gonna need a new hook. A new hook? Yo, despite what happened last night, ladies, the only female I trust that with my life in her hands. I don't trust these other bitches. She's out, man. You saw how shook she got after I blew that nigga's head off last night, man? Yo, Bone, you think lady gonna keep her mouth shut about that Goldie job? Of course. I hope so. Because a dead bitch definitely can't tell the police a damn thing, Bone. Yo, don't you think I know that? I take out myself. I knew she was gonna snitch. I hope so.
Yo, Chase, you ready? All right, get two G's and meet me in the juice bar in like an hour. All right, one. All right, I'm gonna go home and change. Take the car and I'm gonna link up with you later. All right. All right. How much? A brick, but I need you to stretch that shit out for real this time because my money's tight and this recession shit is fucking on my pocket. No, sure. You feel me complaining this shit weak. Yeah, well, I've got to cook this shit down to the oil and beef because we need butter out there in the streets. They keep coming back, don't they? I don't give a fuck. Stretch that shit out. Alright, we got you. Damn, bro, this recession shit hard. That's why it's never good to only have one hustle. Man, but if we sell them blow up, man, shit gonna slow down, man. Especially when they got butter up the block, bitch. I'm looking into other shit, man. Damn, y'all couldn't order a bitch not a drink, no juice, nothing? I ain't your man, shorty. Shit, I'd be your man to do something to eat, drink, all that shit. It's called being a gentleman. You said this yourself, we in a recession. Money tight, right? Besides, I never said I was no gentleman. All right, that's my cue, man. I'm gonna get busy, man. I'm gonna go handle this business and shit like that. That's fucked up. I'm gonna go get my juice. Can I get a little flame and a shot of OG? But it did, and I've been thinking about you ever since. Come on. I'm serious. Like, so what? Well, what I'm serious. Of course, you know I've been feeling you for years now. Chase, you know your community dick, and I can never settle down with a nigga like you. You acting like a nigga can't change, especially for the right woman. I didn't say a man can't change, but I'm not gonna wait for somebody to change. Portia, what other nigga you know is gonna protect you and hold your damn in the streets the way that I would? I don't know. So at least think about me before you shoot me down. Yo, you know that nigga right there? What nigga? The nigga that just walked out of here. I don't know him personally. I know he used to run with Jazz and Geese back in the day. Why, what's up? What's his name? Fresh. Why, what happened? <laughs> like I said, I'm gonna be looking into other shit. Looking into other shit. Oh, you don't know a bitch now, huh, Fresh? No, I don't know you. Just because you know my name doesn't mean you know me. Oh, is that right, huh? Let me tell you what I do know. I know you and your crew robbed and killed Goldie last night. And you don't got that scar on your face because you was cutting yourself shaving. I don't know what you're talking about, man. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Listen, shorty, mind your business before you fuck around and make me get all up in yours. Relax, chill. Your secret's safe with me. As far as I'm concerned, you did me a favor. Goldie was my competition. 
so I really don't care about him clocking out of here early. Then what the fuck you want? Conversation? Because a nigga ain't got time right now, man. Listen, I know Goldie had a lot of money in that apartment, and I'm sure he's not the only one y'all have hit. Jump to the chase, shorty. I got shit to do, man. I want it. I told you before, I know what the fuck you're talking about. Listen, that bitch y'all ran out of there with, that was a little plug or whatever, right? <laughs> she was so scared running down them stairs, I could tell. She nearly pissed on her pants, I bet. She was so cold, right? <laughs> she did. You need a bitch who ain't scared of blood. You that bitch, huh? I sure am. Fuck off my truck. Yo, meet me in the park in three days. I need to talk to you about something. Fresh. What's up, bro? What's good, Cash? How are you? Chilling. Good. You out here early, I see. I mean, doing what I do. All right, all right. Came to see what was going down. I saw Shorty three days ago, man. Who? Oh. Shorty from the Goldie job. The bitch from the hallway? Yeah. She saw you? Yeah, she saw me, man. She ran down on me and all that. She knew my name and all that. What happened? She said she just wanted to talk. Talk? About what? She said she wanted to be a part of the crew, man. Part of the crew, that's it? Yeah. What she want to be a part of this crew for? Last time I checked, we ain't fucking recruiting. No cash. Look, Fresh, I don't trust her. She saw your face and lady's face. She could be fucking with the cops. You ever thought about that shit? I knew I should have took care of her in the hallway, man. I knew it. What'd you tell her? I told her to get the fuck on, man. You ain't tell her shit else? Of course I ain't tell her shit else, man. You know me better than that, man. Think she fucking with the cops? Doubt it, man. You doubt it. Your black ass still free, ain't you? If she was fucking with police, we'd be in jail by now, man. Alright, I feel you on that one, man. I feel you. Look, we still don't trust her. We might have to burn this bitch. I'll tell you the truth, Cash. I just don't get that type of energy from her, man. She doesn't seem like that type of person, man. Seem like that type of person? You don't even know her. What, you got that from talking to the bitch for a hot second? She let you smell a pussy, too? Wake up, man. You're a funny nigga, Cash. Come on. I mean, you saw how she held her own in the hallway that day. Most bitches would've shit on themselves with all them guns pointed at them. Fuck, most niggas would've too. She didn't though, man. Look, she got more heart than most. I give her that. I give her that. That still don't mean we could trust her, Fresh. That still don't mean she won't tell, Fresh. Listen, man. One thing is for sure is I'm not fucking with Lady no more, man. And we definitely gonna need a new hook, man. And you think about replacing Lady? With a chick that can get us a one-way ticket to Rikers on a murder charge and robbery charge? Fuck that. I'll pass. I ain't say we replacing lady with her, man. You ain't gotta say it, Fresh. I see the wheels in your head turning. Look, we don't know this chick like that. We don't know if she can handle what we into. Right. There's no way to find out. It feels iffy, I'm curving. Curving, curving. I don't like being nervous. Girl, we gotta get to this money all fucking winter. Cheers to that. All work, no play. I'm definitely with it. This drink is not bad. I'm gonna go to the desk. I'll be right back. What's up, Porsche? Man, fuck out of here. Get the fuck off of me, I said. We ain't in that hallway. I ain't outnumbered. Listen, my four on the sand. What you want to talk about? About starting over, of course. Fresh. Porsche. Can I get your shots on? Go for it. Can I get your shots on? Put me out, Porsche. My four. I understand, man. The streets is crazy, though. I didn't know if he was trying to set me up or some shit. What made you have a change of heart? Because I asked around about you. And what's your nosy ass find out? 
That's your name, Porsche Garcia. You never seen you a real one. You a hustler at heart. I told you that shit the other day. Yeah, you did. The snitches and cops say the same shit, and it's just that's convincing. Not always that's pretty, but just that's convincing. Enjoy. So you a real one, huh? All facts. I've been in the streets since I was a little girl. Can you handle a gun real well? <laughs> Did it look like you couldn't handle a gun? Did it look like I couldn't handle a gun in that hallway? Yes. What's your name, man? Touch me. Fresh. I'm gonna ride this shit out with you. You know I'm in love with you. I'm gonna do this bit with you. And that's it. I love you. Nah, baby girl. What we had is over. And I don't need nobody finding out about us. What's wrong with you? Are you crazy? What the fuck is wrong with you? I'm you got learning this or something? I'm not going nowhere. You can't follow the basic instructions or something? No. Get the fuck out of here, Sil. No. No. You're not going nowhere. We're gonna ride this bit out together. Your visit's over in May. I love you, Fresh. Excuse me, it's not over until right I there. say it's over. Got one coming back. Who's that? Girl, that was the nigga that pulled that gun out on me. Oh, where? And what he talking about? My favorite topic money. Stop, mommy, please, please stop, mommy, please stop. Hello? Yo, meet me in my crib in 20 minutes. Excuse me, nigga? Just meet me in 20 minutes, man. First of all, I haven't heard from you in two weeks. You talking about come meet you at 2 o'clock in the morning? Fuck out of here. Listen, Portia, I ain't got time for the bullshit. This run pays 20 G's. Now you gonna play 50 goddamn questions with me? You gonna come out and make this money, man? Alright. Alright, I'm in. Alright then. Meet me at 2121st Avenue. Niggas upstairs got two bricks for me for 20000 a piece. He's an eye nigga, but I still don't like to take chances. Mm. I'm gonna go upstairs. I'm gonna make sure he got the work. If everything look good, I'll be back down here to get the money. If I'm not back down here in 20 minutes or so, if anybody else comes down here to get that money, he pull the fuck off immediately and call his number. Alright. Got that? I got it. Alright. This should have taken but a minute. Gun down, bitch. Don't do it, baby girl. It could be a body bag. Where 
is fresh. I don't know anybody named Fresh. Fresh, bitch. Where the fuck who is, is that? Name? I don't know. I don't know who that is. It don't make a difference. We'll end your ass for fresh tonight. I don't know him. I don't know Fresh. You don't know no fresh, huh? I just fucking saw you at the lounge with him two weeks ago. Now tell us where the fuck he is, or I'ma leave your ass down here for the I fucking rats. I don't know who he is. I don't know. Talk I, I, I don't now, know. bitch, or you got to the count of three. I don't know no fucking fries. Just one, <gasps> two. No, no, please, no, please, no, 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 no. Welcome to the crew, man. Fucking asshole! Oh my god! You can trust your fucking ass now. The fuck? Y'all gonna leave me down here? Come get me! The fuck? Press the best pipes, Porsche. I have to be sure about you. You know how these streets are. Motherfuckers claiming they're about that life, but when they back us up against the wall, they gonna do one or two things. Fight or fall. I have to see which one you do. Oh yeah, well your boys is lucky I didn't shoot them as soon as they pulled up to my fucking car. What the fuck is so funny? The gun I gave you was filled with blanks. Oh yeah? Huh. Oh my fucking god. I figured you bust off, couldn't take that chance. It's alright, ma. You ain't mad at me, are you? It's all good. I'm gonna get up to you. Oh, you sure will. Let's get up out of here. That was some little snake ass shit you did. The fuck you talking about? You know what the fuck I'm talking about. You wanna play with my fucking emotions, use me to get to my brother, and then just toss me like trash? Listen, I told you to go the fuck on because I ain't want you waiting no damn 10 years for nigga. I was looking out for your motherfucking ass. <laughs> looking out for my fucking ass. Yeah, I. Yeah, like I told you, take it how you want. Does Portia know about us? No. Good, keep it that way. What, she's better than me? Listen, does she know or not? No. But I'ma tell her. So, stay the fuck out of my motherfucking business. You only fucking want it. You need to keep your hands to your fucking self. Alright, I'm ready guys. Let's go. Bye. Have a good one. Bye. Who is it? No, man. No is no. Yo, I know Lady Bosch that last job, but she's loyal. We don't know nothing about Portia. Listen, man. I told you I'm not dealing with her. She almost got me killed, man. So you making decisions for all of us now? Cash agreed. That's majority rules, man. Please, let me holler at you. 
And Barrett's got the last two baskets. Yo, I'm telling you, son is nice. Hey, I. What? He just made five in a row. Watch him make this next shot. I got a stack on it. Go ahead. Oh! We no longer need your services, Mom. What do you mean? I mean, you out the crew. Look, I know I fucked up last time. All right? I messed up. You know? But, come on. Listen, you out. End the discussion, man. You knew about this? Go home, lady. Go home. We'll talk later. Go. Just go home, lady. No. Hell, motherfucking no. This is the weak ass bitch y'all niggas replacing me with? This prissy ass bitch? Fuck out of here. Fuck out of here. Get over here. Yo, man, yo, come on. Damn, fuck man. Yo, 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 yo. Chill, man. Chill out, man. Get off of me. Chill, Get off of me. Chill. Get off of me. Chill. Fucking bitch. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Fuck. Yo, bitch. What now, huh? Who's the prissy bitch now, huh? Yo, fresh. What's she doing, man? This shit would have never happened if you would have told her she was out the crew, man. Now, you listen to me, okay? The next time you disrespect me, I'm going to pull this trigger. But I'm going to let you go back to living your pathetic little life after you apologize to me. Now say sorry. That's a sweet jumper by Damian Dotson. Say sorry, I'm gonna pull this motherfucking trigger. RJ Barrett back in. He sat early with two quick fouls. I can't hear you. I need it to be a little louder. I need you to say Portia. I'm sorry for disrespecting you. Struggling with his shot early. Good girl. Lakers. You can go back to living simple minded ass out of here. It's not over. Oh god in the boats. Porsche called me an hour ago, man. Tomorrow night we go in. Good with that? Yeah, bro. Why well, ain't convinced, man? What you talking about? You know what I'm talking about. I said I'm good, bro. Get the shit off your chest, nigga. Yo, that shit that bitch did was foul. Boom, lady stepped to her first, man. Nah, bro. She went way beyond defending herself. She crossed boundaries. What she did was no different than what me and you did when we was on island, man. If a nigga stepped to us, we cut his face so fucking bad, he and anybody else watching knew not to fuck with us, man. This ain't the island, Fresh. This ain't the yard. She went too far. She even pointed a gun at me. And I don't go for that. Who's to say she won't go too far on the job? We don't know nothing about this broad. Listen, Bone. Would we be having this conversation if it wasn't your bitch she fucked up? Her being my bitch ain't got nothing to do with this. It has everything to fucking do with it, man. Honestly speaking, man, do you think Lady would have passed that test we put Portia through, man? You saw how damn sick she got after I murked Goldie? This is real talk, nigga, do you? I don't know, and we won't know. And I understand why you had to cut a crew from the loose. I just don't trust this bitch. I just don't. Fuck you keep looking at me like that for, bone. You fucked her? What? You heard me? You fucked her? Hell no, I ain't fuck her. Listen, bone, Porsche's in the crew. She ain't going nowhere. Bitch like that is too valuable to what we got going on. You're gonna have to get used to it. And if I don't? What, her over me? I'm expendable? You're talking stupid, bone. I am? Yeah. Listen, hear me out, bone. We've been brothers since we was kids. And you know I don't trust nobody to watch my back besides you and Cash. Trust y'all niggas with my life. Same here, bro. We've been through some shit. That's what I'm telling you. You need to think about this. Because there's going to have to come a time when you have to choose between us or her. And son, telling me that because that bitch is not going to be an easy decision for you. All right, boom. I'm out here. I gotta go see Tommy, man.
Didn't I tell you what I would do to you the next time you showed your face here? How many times I gotta tell you, Tommy? That shit wasn't my fault. I don't give a fuck. The cops came here asking questions because of your fuck up. That makes you bad for business, Fresh. Hear me out, Tommy. You the best in the business, business I respect. But that fuck up cost me 10 years of my life. I did my time like a man. Streets miss Fresh. Come on, Tommy. What do you need? Five guns with silences. Automatics with extended clips. I hope you have extended cash. This package is gonna run you seven grand. God damn, Tommy, seven grand? You robbing me, man. That's tax for your fuck up. Take it or leave it or risk guns with bodies on them that don't work properly. Money up front, as usual. I'll have someone drop you the money tomorrow, man. Fresh. When I look at you, I see a smart and resourceful hustler. A throwback from my day. Don't let the carelessness be your downfall. And one more thing, Fresh. If the cops come back here asking questions, the streets will be missing Fresh for a different reason. You done? Can I go now? I hope I don't live to regret this. What's going on? You don't look too good. You okay? 
Tommy, talk to me. What's up? So good to see you again. It's good to see you. I just can't wait for the rest of the evening to happen. What you got for me? We'll talk about that in the bedroom, I guess. I'm excited. I like you. <laughs> What the fuck we gonna do? We, gonna, we have to go inside. No. no. What the, what's the matter? I'm pregnant. Pregnant? Please, please don't be mad at me. I, I know that if I told you, you, you wouldn't. The money that you give to me to transport what's inside my stomach could change the life of man and my unborn child. Please, even if I get deported, my baby will still be an American citizen. Something that could never happen in the old country. He could still have a life. Please. Please don't be mad at me, please. Mad at you? Please. We're not mad, right? I'm not mad. We gotta go inside, though. We gotta go inside. <laughs> What's going on? Don't worry. I got this. Let me take care of this. <sighs> Never really liked it, this bitch anyway. Don't, don't invite me over here on a date and you got stuff, personal stuff going on. Like. Ma, listen. Let me handle my business. I got you. I don't want to mess up the plans we got for later on tonight. Right. How can we wrap this bitch up before she starts smelling up the fucking place? Yo, what the fuck? Nigga, she had to use the bathroom, man. That's what the fucking alley's for. Let her fucking take her pants down and squat. Nigga, you know I can't be doing some shit like that besides. You were supposed to tell me we had work coming in today. I don't have to tell you everything anyway. That's your fucking problem. You gotta tell me what the fuck is going on. You know what? Go use the bathroom. Hurry up. You know where it is. Go. Where the hell you think you're going? Did you see anything in here? I'm gonna ask you again. Did you fucking see anything in here? No. Why the fuck am I not convinced? Hey, yo, man, shit, I told you. Fuck I, I told you convinced? she didn't see anything. Mind your man. fucking business between me and this Are bitch right here. Yeah, I'm fucking for real. What the fuck? Did you fucking see anything in here? No, I swear on my mother's grave I didn't you see You better keep that Ray Charles Stevie Wonder shit working for you, you hear me? You hear me? Yes. Go to the bathroom, go to the bathroom. Yo, chill out, man. The fuck is wrong with you, bro? You should be bringing this bitch here. I just told you, she's with me. At the end of the day, man, this is our place of business. You wouldn't have this That's bitch right. up in here. Our place, don't you fucking forget now, that, now, our man, place. Let me the fucking you coke is getting to you, bro. The, the coke is getting, getting to you, man. Here. Yo, you need to chill the fuck out. Go get yourself a fucking There's drink, man. There's something wrong with that bitch, I'm telling I'm you. telling you right now, man, she's with me. That's all you need to fucking know. Ma, you all right? No, not really. What do you mean you're not all right? I told you, let me take care of this. Nah, I need to get up out of here. What are you talking nah, about? Nah, you bugging the fuck out. This and the shit that you got going on. Listen, do me a nah, favor. No, boy, take shit. your ass up out of here. And you know what? I got a bitch on speed down. I don't give a fuck. Leave. Fuck you and your bitches. Fuck you. Fuck you. See you later. Be happy. Let's go. Put your hands up and don't say a goddamn thing. Bitch, what the fuck? Hold up, go to the back. Come on, let's go. This is bullshit. Forget, 
I know who you are and where you live. You don't seriously think you're gonna get away with this shit, do you? Shut the fuck up, all right? Don't worry about what the fuck I can and can't get away with. I told you this bitch was dirty, man. Don, put the fucking gun down. Put the fucking gun down or I'm gonna shoot your fucking friend. Put the gun down. Put it down! I'm gonna shoot him! Don, put it down! To the motherfucking safe, nigga. Now, nigga. Where the fuck is the money bag at, bitch? What? You need confirmation for this nigga, son? <laughs> Three bitch ass niggas with mask on. Wait, bro. I don't want you to kill her. What? What do you mean? I want this bitch to kill her. Yeah. She's the only one in the crew who don't got her hands dirty. Who's to say she won't get caught? She won't snitch. This ain't part of the plan, man. Fuck the plan. That shit you did to my girl a couple of weeks ago don't impress me. You want to impress me? Kill this bitch. Nigga, that ain't part of the fucking plan. Fuck the plan. What? You scared? You a fucking cop? What the fuck? Nigga, get that fucking gun out my face. Screw that. When you show us you're one of us, then I'll take the gun out your face. You don't gotta do this. Fuck that fucking bitch, man. <laughs> Man, what's wrong with you? I'm good. Did you think about what we spoke about the other day? Are you fucking kidding me, Chase? Are you serious? I, I don't got time for no relationships, nothing. I need you to flip my fucking work. No friendships, no relation, no dick, nothing. I want you to flip my fucking work. <sighs> Yo, that's how we are now. That's what's gonna be. All right, watch. No problem. Fuck you. Hey, yo, Buzz, you need to get the money, man. Leave her alone, man. She ain't with that shit, man. Start changing plans on the job without discussing it first, man. Yo, yo chill the fuck yo, out, man. Yo, you know what? Since chill you try out. to put a bitches in the crew, we can't trust. It ain't got shit to do with trust. You just mad your bitch couldn't hold it down like Porsche could. Get out your motherfucking feelings, nigga. I don't trust that bitch. She's gonna be the downfall of this crew, fresh. I can feel it. She took a bitch head off tonight, nigga. What more proof you need than that, motherfucker? That don't mean nothing. I still don't trust her. Yo, I can't do this, bro. I'm out, man. I can't do this. Bone, where the fuck you going? Bone! Bone, where you going? Let me get the fuck on, man. Chill, bro. The crew can't keep going on like this, man. We self-destructing. Yo, this is the car, man. We we'll break bread in the morning, man. One, huh? First person you ever killed? Yeah. Murder is harsh, but it has to be done in this game, you know? If we had let them niggas survive, they would have came back, found out where your mother lives or anybody close to you, and chopped off all ten of their fingers just for revenge. How old were you when you had your first kill? Real young. I was 12 years old. Why'd you do it? I was protecting my mother. My mother was one of them type of women who would have said being punched on. I was one of the type of kids who couldn't accept it. She was an addict. One night, her and her boyfriend getting high and began arguing that she smoked too much of the shit they went in on together. He punched her. He punched her so hard she fell and bust her head open at the table. Blood was pouring from her head. I was angry and scared at the same time. 
I ain't know what else to do but go to her room, go inside her drawer and grab the gun. When I came back out, he saw me and charged. And I squeezed the trigger. From what the doctor say, the nigga was dead before he hit the floor. I'm not proud of it. What you mean? A bad little charm from the west side She fucking with a nigga on the east side Baby, spark it up and let's get high when you hop off the gas, you don't next side. So say what you mean. Who say what's on your mind? So say what you mean. Girl, say what's on your mind. Say what's on your mind, cause you know you still on mine. doing something you wasn't supposed to. You was out there kissing them boys. I know you was. No, Mommy, I wasn't. Don't lie to me. I'm not lying, I swear yeah. to God, Mommy. Yeah, whatever. I'm always talking to me some type of way, acting like she grown. Mommy, you drinking again? You don't tell me anything in this house. You're not grown. Don't tell me what to do in this house. This is my house. What is wrong with you? Hey guys, it's your girl Miss Melanie. You're watching Deja Vu TV. We are live here in East Harlem where there's a string of robberies. We have no suspects or witnesses at the moment. Excuse me, sir. Do you mind if I ask you a question about the recent crime in your area and how do you feel about it? Yes. Um, I feel that it's really disturbing because we have all these police. We got a police station not too far from here. And for all these robberies and this crime to be going on in this area, that's been gentrified and the majority of the people around here it should be more policing more people for this um, community outreach about all the robberies that's happening and it's, it hurts me because I got to pick my wife up at night and then walk my son and he's at uh, 12 years old so and it's kind of um, bad Okay. well thank you for Tuning in and stay tuned. We'll be right back. Can I help you? I'm here to see Joey. And you are? Tell him it's Gino. Gino?
Yeah, Joe, you have somebody here named Gino to see you? All right, I'll send him down. You can go down. Gino, my longtime friend, to what do I hold this honor? Joe. Joey, you heard what they did. Them fucking cocksuckers, they killed my fucking partner. They fucking shot his fucking brains out. Fucking Angie. Fucking Angie. I saw her on the fucking floor dead. It's... I'm gonna deal with that. But right now, I'm not here for that. I got 50 bricks coming in in two weeks. Double dragon. Straight from China. What I need from you... I need you to give me 10 bricks to hold me off for the next two weeks. In return, I'll give you 12 bricks as a way of me saying thank you for this gesture. Please, I really need this. Can you help me? You know, were you followed? I was not followed. You sure? I'm positive I was not followed. You know, forget about the bricks. You know what I want from you? I want you to get these fucking cocksuckers, okay? On my mother's grave. They're fucking dead, dead, dead. You got my word. Thank you. Because I don't need that shit in my fucking neighborhood. They're fucking dead. Don't worry about it. Yo, what up? Yo, Fresh. I think I got something for you, playboy. Talk to me. I just seen Gino. He in a beauty shop. Can you come out and see if you can But I think it's a fuck up. Just give me more time. I'm get back to you and kick shit out. Alright, say no more. Keep me posted. Alright, one. What the hell is going on? But you need to call me back as soon as possible. Shit. Yo, Fresh. What are we gonna do if she don't call us back? I don't know, man. Yo, we won't be able to do this job without getting to that nigga's apartment. We won't be able to get close to him. Think I don't know that, There's man? There's a lot of money gonna miss out. I told you. That bitch hasn't been the same since two weeks ago since that Donna B job. I told you I didn't trust her. Call Judah. Yo, Judah, we gonna have to leave this job for another time, man. Porsche ain't picking up. What? Yo, man, that sound like a personal problem to me, man. Man, y'all get this done before tomorrow, all right? Yeah, all right. That's what I be really speaking. Cause even though this job pissed me off, obviously. We're making nigga piss more is living poverty. Obviously, I gotta work, suck it up and give a smirk. Smiling, even though it hurt and see my boss a fucking jerk. They call it a break. So where the fuck is Porsche at? Driving, I'll tell you. Jack with the white socks. I'm steady slaving for days. Just give me one shot. Slaving all day, slaving all night. We work slow days and we work slow nights. Slaving all day, slaving all night. We work slow days and we work slow nights. Slaving all day, slaving all night. We work slow days and we work slow nights. So quit playing fucking games with me, man. Where Porsche at, man? I don't know. Fuck you mean you don't know? She just made me sign on a lot of fucking money, man. All right, she left. Left? Fuck you mean she left? Where'd she go? Like she left, left. I sent her to Atlanta. But you know you're still sexy as hell, right? 
So, quit playing games with me, man. I ain't playing. And so it's seeming it's dreaming the rapping ain't working. On a professional level, it's so objectionable, shovel. I'm doing dirt with, so every day I work shit. I'm steady slaving, behaving just like I'm roots telling. Bitch, you need to think about getting out the game too. Like, the same rules that apply to me apply to you. You stay in this hustle for one minute too long and that's it. It's game over, no resets. And when it happens, you're not even gonna see it coming. That's the fucked up part. You, I know you're not listening, you're not convinced because we've been hustling in the streets since we was kids. I get it. But girl, there's bigger things out there. We can't just stay in the streets of the rest of our lives. Think about it. Yeah, I got you. You sure? I need you to really think about this. I'm, I'm getting out the game, and I don't want, I don't need you in the game as well. I don't know. In the meantime, though, I got like one or two more things. You gonna come back on me? That's what I'm saying. Get this money. Gucci purses and Prada jeans, Rolexes and champagne. Living life like we rock stars. They keep asking shout for a man. Ain't nothing that's better than your bounce. Now you're in the middle, you down. Y'all got something for me? Pussy, what's up? I've been calling your phone for like a whole week now. We losing crazy money out here. What you mean? Chase ain't come last week to hit y'all off? Hell no. I've been calling his cell phone like crazy. Nobody even seen a nigga either. Get the fuck out of here. All right, I'm gonna I'm see y'all in a bit. Yo, so, you seen Chase? Nah, not since you left. You serious? I'm dead serious. Oh my fucking god. This all right, let's go see 2G's real quick. I gotta pull up on him. I gotta see where, where Chase is at. All right, we out. What's up? You know you look good, right, baby? Thank you. What's up? What are you doing later? What you wanna do? I wanna have some fun. I know that. All right, so let's go somewhere. All right, baby. Yo, 2G's. Yo, you seen Chase? No, I ain't seen him. I'm waiting for him. So you ain't come get you to cook the work last week? Nah, no, ain't he not answering the phone? What's up, do you still need me? Nah, yo, we good. I'm, I'm gonna hit you up in a little bit. Uh, Come on, let's go, let's go. Oh my God. He's not here. This mother... He took everything. Everything. That was the last of it. This... 
Let's go. Come on. Fuck out of here. You gonna let me in? Man, I'm not in the mood for your shit. You think I care about what mood you in? You need a crew hanging on a job. Come back a week later, talk about what mood you in. Who you think you are, man? Fresh, I made a mistake. I'm human. And you know how I feel about mistakes in this line of work, man. Fresh, come on. Listen, man, I fought my nigga to keep you in this crew. The nigga who got my back since the sandbox. I did that shit because I thought you was worth it, man. Oh, so me rocking down these bitch to sleep isn't enough to hold down my position? Hell no. There's more to being a part of this crew than just squeezing triggers, man. Oh, yeah, like what? Loyalty. We don't run out on each other, man. I didn't run out. The hell you didn't? You knew we had a job to do. Instead of being here to hold down your part, you chose to run off to Atlanta. How'd you know I was in Atlanta? Listen, man, doesn't matter how I know. What matters is you weren't here when we needed you, man. Fresh, I'm sorry. That Don B job, that messed me up. That sliced open body, rocking his bitch to sleep, that shit messed with my head. I've been seeing that in my dreams. I needed to get away. I needed to clear my head. So, and of course, what me and you did the other day. So what happens the next time you got a body in another motherfucker? The next time you see too much blood? You gonna run out on us again like a coward, man? Come on, Fresh. I can't keep putting my crew in jeopardy over you, man. I can't keep taking chances on you, man. First you bailed out on me when me and you had an altercation. Then you bailed on the entire crew, man. I can't keep doing it, man. Fuck away from my door. Yo, what up, mom? Yo, what's good? Where's Makala at? He in the back. But why you knocking on the door like you the popo or something? Man, he knows I look I'm like some type of illiterate nigga to you or something. He knows I'm coming. Damn, what the fuck? Where's he at? Is he here or is he not? Yo, Miguel! Yeah. Porsche out here, yo. Let in. He in the back. So you come to do business with Poppy again, huh? After I slight misunderstanding, I thought I lost a valid customer. Man, that shit you pulled on me last week, that shit was mad whack. I expect you to do better this time. I'm an honest drug dealer. Why I purposely sell you some bullshit? This uh -huh. package I got is brutal. All right, I hope so for your sake. You got Where my money? Yeah. When you told me your money was low, I thought you was going to offer me some pussy for the package. This nigga. I read a package, that pussy tight and nice. And it smell good, too. <laughs> You will never find out. Manny, get the bricks for this beautiful young lady. All right. It's all good. Good. I'll be back. Now hurry up, man. You act like I don't have shit to do too, bitch. Fuck off. Hey yo, the rain was steady blowing, heard it drop, she was meant to be Shelling in my crib, no doubt, peep the scenery Telephone rang, then it stopped before I could answer it I heard it knock at the door, so I answered it It was Jermaine, he had a little situation Beef up on the block, and off the doctor led the confrontation He said these cats be acting hard on the block Maybe pumping weight and holding, so Dwayne got shot Now see, Dwayne was just a knucklehead, but still with his cousin And I'll be wrong if I ain't help him when his beef, he gon' rush And he said, listen, listen, homie, ain't no time for discussion Motherfucker Fucking pressures rising in this ball in the bus. So if you with me, then you with me, nigga. Make a decision. Got the bait, you be the hook, cause we's about to go fishing. Now listen, when it's on, then it's on for show. Kiss my girl up on the head and in the wind up the dough. Stun up in the dark, the dark, it comes to light. So always play your part, your part, and say goodnight. Stun up in the dark, the dark, it comes to light. So always play your part, your part, and say goodnight. Stun up in the dark, the dark, it comes to light. So always play your part, your part, and say goodnight. Stun up in the dark. On the block and it's raining, it's hard to see shit All I seen is six headlights, that means it's three whips Three chicks hopped at the whip, they had some heaters with them Walked up on it slowly and told me they wanted to get to know me Jermaine was scoping them bitches, he beat their strategy They took us to a building with children, they watching actually But naturally, took us to the basement to stand I see the girl in the corner, but they told me he's dead You think you shoot? You think you shoot? Get off of me! Stop! Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? You got me fucking chasing you? Hey guys, this is your girl Miss Melanie. You're watching Deja Vu TV. I'm live here in East Harlem on 124th Street where we have two 
men that were murdered. And I have actually one of the residents of the building where the men were murdered. Her name is Miss Watkins. How are you doing today, Miss Watkins? Good, how are you? I'm good, thank you. Now, can you share a little bit of um, what happened here? Do you, did you see anything, hear anything? Um, I didn't see anything, but I heard gunshots from my apartment. Um, it was pretty scary. It was in Just that it's shocking because it's a very quiet building. I've been here for 45 years and we've never had a problem. Everyone pretty much knows one another, you know your neighbors, so it's kind of alarming. Okay, well, I'm really sorry you guys are experiencing this. Make sure you guys stay tuned to Deja Vu TV. We'll be bringing you the latest update. Hold on a minute. Can you have this seat over there? Hey, Thank you. So, Miss Miss Watkins, uh, you know why we're here? Um, I think I have an idea. You have a seat. Okay, so I just have a couple of quick questions for you. Okay. Uh, there was a shooting last night. You know, um, I don't know if you were up or if you were at home when the shooting was going on, but we're just trying to find out if maybe you've seen something or heard anything, anything you might be able to tell us that might help our case. Um, as a matter of fact, I did. Did you see anyone fleeing the scene or, or leaving from anywhere? Uh, anything you might be able to tell us that, that can help? Like, Oh, I saw a young lady leaving one of the apartments. Around about how tall would you say she was? Between five four five five. Okay, black, white, Spanish. Um, she was either Hispanic or African American. Okay. Can you tell me what this young lady was wearing? She had on a a black hoodie mm -hmm. and some gray stretch pants. Was she alone? Yeah, she was alone because she. I remember she was carrying this he rather heavy bag, and mm -hmm. it was difficult for her to carry. Okay. Miss Watkins, would you happen to know a Manny or Miguel? Miguel is my neighbor. Okay, anything you could tell me about Miguel? Um, he's rather respectful, nice young man. Um, I just noticed that he has a lot of people coming and going at all hours of the night from his apartment. How long you know Miguel? I've known him for a long time. I've lived here all my life. So you know everything? Yeah, you know, sometimes I'm up at night, pacing the floor, reading my Bible, and I happen to look through the peephole and you, um, see a lot going on. I just want to be safe. Okay. This is your children? Yes, my children and my grandchildren. I see she just graduated. Yes, she did. The first one of the grandchildren to graduate. All right, Miss Watkins, we thank you for your time and your cooperation. You've been very helpful. Thank you, officers. Anything I can do to help? If it's, if it's anything you think of, you can reach us here. Thank you so much, officer. Don't be afraid to use the phone. I won't. Thank you. Appreciate Thank you for your help. You have a good night, Ms. Watkins. You too. Thank you, officers. I feel safe just knowing you all around. You got a nice apartment, too. Thank you. I've lived here all my life. Can I have an app? No, that's for my kids. Got a lighter? No, I don't have a lighter partner. I will offer you one. But to be honest, I just don't want to. Man, what am I in here for? First of all, you got me confused with a person that likes misconception. I'm not that person. Misconception confuse things. They slow down the process. For an example, you have a misconception how this interview is supposed to start. You think you're going to be running shit and you're going to ask the questions. It's not going to happen. 
It's going to start by you telling us where the gun is. What gun? The gun our officers saw you coming down the staircase with. The gun that we know that you used to murder Manny Miguel. Mira, no te ponga estúpida. Hmm. Don't get stupid. You better listen to him. This is double homicide, sweetheart. Tú estás famosa. You're famous now. You in the big leagues. Man, I don't know nothing about no murder. I don't know shit. But you know Miguel Lopez, don't you? Just because I know a motherfucker don't mean I killed him. Well, how do you know him? He's a friend. What kind of friend? A friend, that's it. No, Miss Garcia. He's not just a friend. He's your plug. Mm. In fact, I know he was. I bet my pension on it. I don't know nothing about no gun or nothing. He's... Really? So this, this friend, this so-called friend, when was the last time you saw your quote-unquote friend? It's been a while. What's a while? A while. That's I it. need to know days. I need to know months. I need to know weeks. Mm. A couple weeks. I don't know. Are you sure about yeah, that? Yeah, hell yeah, I'm she, sure. She playing games, man. So you saying you didn't see him tonight? Nope. So you saying you didn't speak to him at any time today? No. So what the fuck you was doing in that building? Visiting a friend. What's your friend's name? Deja. And what's your friend's apartment number? 304. Man, look, I wish I could help y'all find whoever did this, but I can't. I don't know what happened. Mm. She don't know what happened. No. You're cute. You're really cute. <laughs> you know what else is cute, man? You know them big burly bitches down the road? They like cute ones like her. You know what else they like to do? They like to pass your pussy around for ramen noodles and cigarettes. Yeah, that's what they like to do. Exactly. Look, I don't know shit. Yeah. You don't know, huh? Man, look, I don't know anything, all right? And I'm done talking to you. I want my lawyer. Right. No problem, Miss Garcia. No problem. Shit, if I was charged with double homicide, I would want a lawyer too. Hell yeah. In fact, to be honest, that's the smartest decision that your dumbass made all night. <laughs> oh, for the record, Miss Garcia, you're gonna love this one. We know that you spoke to Miguel today because the incoming call on his cell phone will show that. Mm. We also know that you shot him tonight. Because sure the gunpowder la mano do ya in your hands will also prove that. Even if, even if my officers can't find the gun that you tossed tonight, we got something just as good. <laughs> sure do. Got a witness. <laughs> I'm a dito. Mm. Te cagaste. Te cagaste bad. You fucked up. You fucked up bad. Real bad. Real bad. Come on, ladies, hurry up. Let's move this line. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Yo, I heard you got a new bunkie. Oh, shit. Are you serious? Where is she? Stop coming back. Extra hot dog, you eating for two. Oh, yeah. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Can I get another juice? No. So 
hog food was better than this shit. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? Not a bad you? day? No. Yeah, get your cup. Come on, let's Thank move the line. Let's move the line. Let's go, baby. Here we go again. Is this ever going to end? I don't know, baby. Maybe you should stop coming back to prison. Can I get two of those? Yeah. Can I get two of what? Hot dogs. You ain't home? You ain't pregnant? Oh, I gotta be pregnant? Yeah. yeah. You want a special diet? I tell you. Who the fuck are you? Well, what's your name? Why? You don't know me and I don't know you. Look, I don't want any problems, okay? I'm just asking your name, that's all. I don't know you. Well, I heard that the two of us are going to be sharing a cell, so I just thought that it would be like a good idea for us to know each other's names. I mean, it would keep the tensions down between me and you and around here a little. So instead of us, you know, walking around like, hey, you. No? Okay, so, my, I'm, what's your name? Like, my name is Angel. Portia. Is that your real name? That's the name my mother gave me. You ever asked her, like, why she named you that? Never really got a chance to. She died when I was nine. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, but I feel you. Mine's died when I was only six. Um, so, like, what are you in for? Murder. Who did you kill? Nobody. Oh. I'm in for the same thing. The only difference is I actually did it. Who'd you, I mean, why'd you kill him? He raped me. Yeah, but it's his baby, if that's what you're wondering. Are you serious? As a heart attack. The only... <sighs> it's, it's just, well, the first time, though, was, like, the last time that I actually had the courage to, like, do something about it. He raped me so many times throughout the years, like, I couldn't even keep track. How old are you? I'm 18. Um, so like, Portia, do you play spades? No, I'm good. Oh, well, I'll holler at you later uh, then. Bye. Come on, lady, let's eat up, let's eat up. Here we go again. Hey, boo. How you doing? What's going on? How you holding up? It's a process, girl, but I'm doing it. You know ain't no walls or barbed wire fences gonna break me and hold me back. I know that's right. You whoop anybody's ass yet? Because I know how you are. <laughs> nah, girl. I stay to myself. If they don't fuck with me, I don't fuck with them. I ain't really trying to get to know none of these bitches in here. I feel you. You see anybody we know up here? Nah, I, I, for the most part, I stay in my cell. I'm not really trying to make friends, to see friends, nothing. Yeah, that's the only way to be. Just stick to yourself. It's the only way to be. But overall, we missing you out there. I know. How you feeling? I just miss my freedom. I'm sure you're missing some dick, too. <laughs> Girl, we gonna throw you the only party when you get home. I can't wait. <laughs> we turning up. So be quiet down now. I can't wait my damn self, shit. This shit is for the birds. I know that's right. Portia, you sure you okay? Yeah, I just miss the streets like crazy sometimes. I know, you're gonna be out of here soon. Soon enough. Mm -hmm. So how's the case going? What the lawyers talking about? I mean, it's just 
I really won't know anything until my first preliminary hearing, and that could take months. Damn. Have you been speaking to any lawyer? Yeah, she can't really tell me nothing new right now because I'm not taking no plea bargain, and she just told me be prepared for trial. I feel you. Yo, speaking of my lawyer. What's up? I need you to do me a favor. The day I got caught by the cops, I stashed a bag full of money and bricks behind that alley in 305. I need you to go get that and hit my lawyer off with like a hundred grand. All right? Okay. I ain't fucking with no public defender. Fuck that. Then the rest of the money, I need you to put it in the bank. Okay. I got you. What about the bricks though? Get with two G's, cook that shit up, bag it up, hit the crew off. Just cause I'm locked up don't mean we can't get money while I'm in here. I know that's right, I feel you. I really need you, so you're all I got while I'm in here. I really need you to come through for me. Portia, I, I got see you. see the time almost up. I, I need you. Just trust me, I got you. Hey! I didn't see you at child today. I brought you something. <laughs> you look like a corned beef room inside with girl. Girl, I cannot eat that stuff with a child. I completely understand. That's why I got my job in the kitchen though, because I was like that the first two weeks I got here. But you know what? I, I am eating for two, so that's why I can eat what I want, whenever I want in that kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> can I ask you something? Sure, go ahead. What are you gonna do when the baby's born? I mean, what if you get a lot of time in here? I'm young, but I'm not naive. I know that as soon as I have this baby, they're gonna take it away from me. I'm just, I'm just trying to enjoy motherhood right now for as long as I can. It's like, it's, it's just the only thing that's keeping my mind off the fact that I'm probably gonna be in here for the rest of my life. So. I'll say that. It's, it's the truth. It's gonna be okay. I promise. Okay. I'll believe you for now. <laughs> All right, bye. They'll pick up. I've been calling you for two fucking weeks. We're waiting for yeah, wait that phone. Turn, wait your turn. Oh my Let's get that phone going. Come on, five minutes. Let's go. Let's go. I got call with me. Hey, wait your turn. Fucking phone. So come on. I'm calling you for two fucking weeks. Come on, man. Come on, if you can't get through, let's move it. Incident like that, you're gonna be in the box. All right, come on, let's go, let's go. You make your phone call after the count. Why? She took on my phone. Because I said so after the count. Let's go. What the fuck you want? Bitch? You know what the fuck I want, bitch. I've been waiting for this moment so long, and my tits is hard. Man, fuck you, bitch. Hey, my daughter, get the fuck off of her. I've been waiting for this moment a long time, bitch. 
Hope you enjoy it as much as I'm about to. <laughs> Time, man. Games on half time right now. What's up, man? What's going on? What's up, fresh? I apologize for something, bro. What's up, What's going on? Yo, when was the last time you heard from that broad Porsche? Man, you know I don't fuck with that, bro. Ever since you left us hanging on that job, man. Facts. Feel you on that. Well, what's up, man? I just came from the state for visiting lady. State? Yeah. Thought she was on Rikers, man. Nah, man. She got transferred on a murder charge. Murder charge? I don't know girls were boosting stomped out some pregnant lady. He killed her and the baby. Dang. Yeah. But that's not all, though. Sure. Lady was telling about some chick she cut up on the island. Word? Lady up in that motherfucker wildin' like that? Yeah, man. I didn't think she had it in her to get down like that, man. I heard the girl she cut up was, uh, Portia. What? Yeah. <sighs> Listen, man. Me and Portia never got along, but I will never wish no harm on nobody like that. 
And I don't know how bad she got cut up, though. But I just felt I had to tell you. You are right, bro? Good, man. Sure? Yeah. All right, man. I just had to drop that news on you, bro. I got to get out of here some business. Hey, oh, hey, ooh, hey, oh, hey. Face all your father's car. case looking? Not good. What do you got? A witness. No murder weapon? What exactly did the witness see? What do you want, Fresh? Came here to see you, Portia. All right, you see me. I look like a circus freak. Portia, you're still beautiful. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. What do you want? I want to be here for you, and I want to help you beat this case. I appreciate the gesture, but trusting people is not one of my best attributes. Not anymore. And I refuse to get betrayed, so I'm sorry you wasted your time coming over here. Yeah. Portia, I love you. I love you since the first time I laid eyes on you. Maybe I should have said something one time when you were being here. I guess. I guess I let my pride in you. But I love you and I know you feel the same way about me, don't you? Don't you? I do. I want to help you beat this case. And you're going to come home and you're going to get married. Is all that all right with you? Yes. Hey, Miss Watkins, come on, how you doing? Let's make this nice and easy, guys, oh, Ma. Come on, Grandma. Shh. Nice and easy, stay right here. Just turn around. Nice and easy, Grandma. Shh, it's okay. Keep going, what do you want? Look, we ain't got time for bullshit. 
a damn shame beating up a poor disrespectful old woman. Y'all generation ain't got no respect for your elders. There's a special place in hell for the three of you. God's got one for you all. Listen, Rosa Parks, save that shit for church service on Sunday. Right now, you and I got business with each other. Oh my God. Do, do I look worried to you? I'm 65 years old. My days are numbered and borrowed. What are you gonna do? Kill me? I ain't scared of dying. Hell yeah, I'm testifying against that bitch. Matter of fact, I'm gonna get there early to make sure I don't miss nothing. I figured it. Ta-da. My family? My family don't have nothing to do with this. The fuck they don't. They got everything to do with it that I say they do. What do you want me to do? Something simple. Tell the prosecutor in court that the woman on trial is not the same woman you saw entering and leaving the building the night of murder. You don't testify, and no harm comes your way. If you do testify, me and my disrespectful heathens here make sure they die real slow deaths. Oh my God. It's to you. Be smart. What's it gonna be? Okay, okay. I won't testify. criminal division system is now in session with presiding judge Crawford you may be seated bailiff Spooner please swear in the jury raise your right hand do each of you swear you will fairly try this case before the court that you will return a true verdict according to the evidence and the instructions of the court so I help you God if so say I do I, I do. do you may be seated your honor today's case is the state of New York versus Portia Garcia members of the jury your duty today will be to determine whether the defendant is guilty or not guilty by the facts and the evidence presented in this case. Is the prosecution ready? Yes, Your Honor. Be seated. Is the defense ready? Yes, Your Honor. Be seated. Your Honor, members of the jury, we're here today because on September 8, 2019, Portia Garcia took a handgun and two intentional shots that killed Miguel Lopez and Manny Rodriguez. Prosecution will prove to you beyond reasonable doubt that Ms. Garcia is guilty of murder in the first degree. The state of New York wishes to provide justice and closure to the Lopez and Rodriguez families. We are confident that the weight of evidence we intend to present throughout the course of this trial will render the defendant guilty. Your Honor, ladies and gentlemen of the jury, under the state law, my client, Portia Garcia, is innocent until proven guilty. She stands here before you, falsely accused of first degree murder and a double homicide. That is a very serious matter. The state of New York wants justice, and we want justice too but for the right person. At the end of the trial, all we ask is that you render the right verdict, not guilty. Thank you. Prosecution, you may call your first witness. The people call Ms. Watkins to the stand. Raise your right hand. Do you promise the testimony that you're giving the court today is the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth, so I hope you got? Ms. Watkins, if you refuse to swear in, you will be found in contempt. Your Honor, may we have five minutes in your chambers, please? Ms. Watkins. Yes, Your Honor. If you refuse to testify, I have no choice. I have to subpoena you. You're wasting my time. You're wasting the court's time. Make a choice. Your Honor, I'm afraid. Of who? I'd rather not say, Your Honor. Miss Watkins, I cannot help you unless you tell me who you're afraid of. 
Your Honor, if you need to subpoena me, I understand. But can you protect my family? I cannot protect your family if I don't know who I'm protecting you from. There's a lot at stake, Your Honor. My family's in danger. I don't feel comfortable saying. Miss Watkins, make a choice. Your Honor, may I go now? Please go. Ma'am, you got to be kidding me. After two whole weeks of sitting at that deliberation table, you're going to tell me Miss Portia Garcia is not guilty because she's a woman? No, that's not what I'm saying, sir. What I'm saying is just because she was at the scene of the crime, that doesn't mean she committed the murder. It's a tenement. There were hundreds of people there. There were a ton of people there. Right. How can, how can it be only her? Come on now. The cops said they seen her and she ran from them. And why would she run if she wasn't guilty? I could think of plenty of reasons why she would run. One, she was scared. She was scared. She could have been nervous. Wouldn't you run if you saw a cop? But why is she scared and nervous if she's not guilty? She ever met a cop you could trust? There's not a high level of trust for police officers in that community, right? Does she have any priors? Sure. Priors or no priors. Guilty is guilty. There was a gun on the scene. Where's the evidence? Mm. Now I hear you. But I also heard three cops say the same exact thing. Three cops? Yeah, Were they three male? Cops. Were they female? Were they biased? Were there any witnesses? They said they seen Miss Portia Garcia with a gun in her hand. And she ran from them. Now coming from where I come from, a gun plus a run, that equals guilty. Not and coming from where I come from, you can't trust the cops. There's what? no there's no evidence, real evidence. She didn't get caught with the gun. There's no real witness. It's just three cops saying the same thing. Look, I think we just need to keep track of the, the information that was presented for the case, right? Let's not make any assumptions. There's no gun, right? No clear evidence connecting Miss Garcia with actually the crime. So I say she's not guilty. There's no witnesses. Right. I think we don't know enough. Will the jury four-person please stand? Has the jury reached a verdict? Yes, we have, Your Honor. Will the defendant please rise? Read the verdict. Read the jury of the state of New York versus Portia Garcia finds the defendant not guilty. Oh, thank God. Yeah. Jury, the court thanks you for your time. The defendant is free to go. Court is adjourned. You did it, baby. No, you did it. You made this happen. Thank you for giving me my life back. Closer, closer, closer. A little closer, closer from the last one.
play you, baby. It's more than that. I'm looking for a good vibration. Trying to celebrate, but ain't no celebration. He's sexy. Hey. I love when you call me that. Yeah. We can go out and celebrate. No, I want to stay here with you and sleep and lay down. You sure? Mm-hmm. I got something to tell you. What is it? It ain't nothing bad. Chill, man. Get out the game, baby. You sure that's what you want to do? I was sure that day I came to see you on Rikers. I got one more job to do after it's done. I want to marry you, move away, and start a family. You want to marry me? Indeed, I do. I love you. I love you, too. Boy, what's up, bro? What's poppin'? What up? Called you here today to tell you I'm getting out the game, man. You doing what? I'm getting out the game. You got the game? Ain't shit for me no more, man. Get out the game? Yeah. Why? Just wanna do right by poor, so move the fuck up out here. It's all the family, man. Fuck all that. We lit right now. I got everything set up. It's a go right now. We about to eat. Listen, man. Listen to what I'm telling you, man. What? Ain't shit left for me no more, man. You gotta know when to get in and when to get out, man. Ooh, are you crazy? No, I'm not crazy. Do I look crazy? Oh, man? I know what it is. This nigga scared. <laughs> scared of what? Oh, man. I'm the realest motherfucker you ever gonna see, and you know that shit, man. And I know that. So what you talking about right now? We well, lit right now. I got everything set up. Listen, listen. We gonna go in there. We gonna get this motherfucking money. And we good. Listen to what I'm telling you, man. I'm either gonna wind up dead on fucking jail if I listen to you, man. What you talking about? This jail and scary here, shit man. you talking about? Ain't nothing about being scared, man. You just gotta know when to get out, man. All the work we done put in? Yeah. Now you gonna say it's a, us getting killed? Listen, going to jail. Man. What I'm gonna do is we connect We right you. here, bro. This is the biggest lick we ever had. We ain't never had no big shit like this before. We good right now. We do this one last hit tomorrow at 9 o'clock and we good. I'll blow her fucking head off next. It makes no difference to me. She died this motherfucker. You sons of bitches don't know what you just did. Your family is dead. You're all dead. Put your hands up, old man. Move slow, motherfucker. You just opened a Pandora box. Shut up, old man. Take us to it. Watch the door. Open a Pandora box. Shut the fuck up. Lay down. You ain't gonna live long enough to spend this. None of you will. This is L Wing from Deja Vu TV. We just got a report in from 111th Street and 1st Avenue. It seems that three armed gunmen has just ran into a local business store. Guns were blazing, shots fired, and Hold on, according to what's coming in right now, one or maybe all of their suspects have been wounded or injured. We'll get back to you as reports come into the station. And you were mine, and I was yours. We were fine, but I closed doors. No space of time could change it all. But now we find these vacant halls where those pictures used to be. Now we're shattered, broken glass. And every time I walk across. A reminder of our past Like I don't give a damn about it But you know that's not true And I wish that you could change your mind But you know that's not you I mean I don't even think about another girl Just the music now that you're gone Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah I've been on the road playing lots of shows For the fans doing me, oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah
Sometimes I still think about how my Yeah, I'm chilling, man, for real, man. That's my business, man. You already know how we doing it, man. Sunny Lee. Hey, look, mama, check this out, though. I'm fucking with a real one, you hear me? <laughs> and they talk to him. <laughs> oh, I feel like losing my mind tonight. I feel like losing my mind. I feel like losing my mind. Oh, I In the nighttime, ice bucket with the white wine. You know she rocking with the right guy. Shout it bad with the light eyes. She killing them like Lauren Hill. A compliment to the foreign wheels. But you gotta keep it more than real. Sex on the beach just for the thrill. They don't do it like she do. Pull us something new when I see you. Put ice in your watch just to be cool. And all that just to preview. You know my crib is the hot spot This song got them jumping like it's hopscotch And I'ma keep grind, I will not stop Sunny Lee and they got the top spot Oh, I feel like losing my mind tonight Feel like losing my mind, feel like losing my mind Oh, I can't believe that you are mine Can't believe that you are mine